Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Yu-Gi-Oh! Stardust, M Stardust Accelerator. Yu-Gi-Oh! 5D Stardust Accelerator. That's the one I was going for. In this episode, we're going to be dueling this guy, who is uh, Kid, I believe. So, um, again, between the last episode and this one, I dueled uh, Callisto four more times. Unlocked a new uh, duel spirit to duel in the World Championship mode. Which turned out to be um, Battery Man. Battery Man DD, I believe. No, but Battery Man Microcell, I think. Draw! Draw! Yeah. Hmm. Destruction Jammer is always a nice thing to have face down. Galahad's definitely not going to be helpful. I'll play Ghost Guard in defensive, defensive mode. I will probably also go with Kunoit Chain because I'm feeling uh, threatened, threatened right now <laughs> by uh, a new deck that I don't know anything about, basically. Hey, look, it's Galahad again. <laughs> yeah, so... Um, Kid here has a, uh, a deck based around the X Saber monsters like Galahad, and uh, as a result, he's got quite a f he's got lots of warrior monsters in his deck. I'm mm. I'm going to prevent that attack because I don't want to I don't want to lose my defense right now. Draw. Defense draw is nice. I'll play it face down. Then I'll summon X Saber Galahad as well. And that's bottomless trap hole. Uh, but I'm going to cancel it out with destruction jammer. I don't really need Ryoku. I want to keep my monster on the field far more than I want to deal him actual damage. Is he in defense mode? Why is he in defense mode? How did you become in defense mode? What the hell? Or am I just looking at it wrong? I'm pretty sure I'm not. Uh, wait, it was Kuno with Chain that forced him into defense mode because... Oh my, 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 my. I'm not feeling too great today. My head hurts a little. So, please excuse me if I play horribly and forget what I've done. Like that. Like what happened just there, because that that's just embarrassing right there. There's uh, Anna Polera. Yeah. Galahad's going to uh, lose attack points because he's the one getting attacked. I'm going to throw the. Uh, I, I'm going to activate the uh, defense draw trap card, which allows me to draw another card, and as a result, prevent my damage. Boop, 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 boop. Draw. That's nice. Skill Dunk Magician is very nice, actually. I'll play Compulsory Evacuation Device face down. Skill Dunk Magician in attack mode. Still leaving Ghost Gardener because I don't want to. Uh, I don't want to waste it. I don't want to waste that potential 1,000 damage, uh, 1,000 attack point cut. I think. I also have Blast Sphere in case anything goes horribly wrong and I need to get rid of a, a monster. <laughs> you can attack Ghost Gardener if you wish, but it's not going to help much. Because <laughs> you're taking the damage, my friend. Again, it's only a little bit of damage, but it's nothing... Uh, it's not too... It's not, it's not that significant, but it is at least something. Okay, this is a nice, this is a nice, uh, a nice draw right here. Hmm. Creator. Tempted now, so I think I will. I'm going to tribute. Mm. Yeah, I'm going to tribute uh, Ghost Gardener and Skill Dunk Magician to summon the Creator. Da -da 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 -da. And now I can discard a card in my hand to uh, 
to resurrect a monster from my graveyard. Or you can do stuff like that, because you're a dick. I hate you. I hate- I really hate you. You just wasted all of my effort. I didn't expect a warrior deck to have things like that. I guess I underestimated it. Oh well. Won't be something I do again. <laughs> Xsaber Palamo. Synchro Summon. Well, this is uh, convenient. What are you? When it's kind of synchro summon, you can special special summon a level four below warrior type monster from your hand. What is Paloma? Palomo? Pa Palomlo? Palomlo? Hmm. Interesting. I'm going to activate compulsory evacuation device. I'm returning that X Saber Synchro Monster to your extra deck. Um, interesting. This card cannot be destroyed by battle. While this card is in face-up defense position, 1,000 damage during each opponent's standby phases. So basically, it's a it's a weak card that can't be destroyed by battle, but you can't keep it in defense mode because it costs you life points. That's okay. Draw! That's a start. Um, Tune Warrior or Blast Sphere? I'm going to throw Blast Sphere. Because I don't really have any real interest. I have, I have no real interest in actually activating its effect. And I don't know whether or not he has a monster in his hand that requires a tribute, or whether. He has a, he's just drawn a monster that's better than this thing and that can kill my blast sphere like that one. Although it couldn't have actually it actually couldn't have killed my tune warrior without taking itself down as well. So what's this one do? Contribute this card to put the destroyed card on the top of its owner's deck. Interesting choice. Not a fan of that kind of ability, but hey. Draw! That's something. It's in defense mode. It's costing him life points. Why are you bothering? Dust Tornado and Toon Warrior in attack mode. For now, at least. Again, I don't know whether or not he has a monster that... Uh, whether he has a tuner or whether he has a... Um, Dust Tornado won't stop that. And just destroy it. Galahad's no tuner. What are these two? Okay, Paisal is a tuner, so he's going to have s le six levels on his field, yeah. And yet he's not using them. Interesting. Ow, that's 500 damage. I'm not too bothered about that. Ow. Yeah, I'm. I'm I mean, maybe maybe he doesn't have any level six uh, synchro monsters to use use his tuners with. Draw. That's a start. That's costing you life points every turn, my friend. Crebon's in attack mode. I'm not going to attack because that would be foolish. But I I can keep Crebon's on this on the field for several turns. But via using its effect. And again, doesn't matter if I lose life points as long as I haven't lot as I don't lose the last of my life points. But put me into stupid damage range. Spare. Damn it. He's losing life points faster than I am. Despair I can't use right now. I think I'm gonna have to. Uh, Leave Crebons out there. <laughs> Again, I'd, I'd rather not, but I don't have much of a choice right now. It's the only thing that's actually that's keeping him from me. That... Mm, Palomo. No, can't stop that one either. Got a lot of instant cast spells. <laughs> There's a Synchro. Yeah, not surprised. <laughs> And warrior type monster from your hand. 
Oh wow, he's double synchroing. That's a level eight, I think. No, it's a level seven. Okay, then this X Saber guy is level five. So X Saber Urbellum. He apparently has four or more cards in his hand with this card of. That's not going to help. It's not going to uh, affect me at all. Yes, I'm activating Creebon's ability. Again, it's only it's only going to cost me 1,600 life points to keep the only monster I have access to on my field. I think this is a perfectly acceptable co uh, expenditure. Hmm. Now that's going to help. 1,500, 800. I activate Smashing Ground. Smashing Ground destroys the monster on the field with the, high, with the highest defense points. A, a enemy's mo uh, opponent's monster on the field with the highest defense points. <laughs> okay, he's no longer losing life points. This power up isn't going to help you, especially seeing uh, it's not even worth uh, stopping it at this point. His attack points mean nothing as long as Creebons is out on the field currently. Is, is, yeah, as long as Creebons is out on the field. Because his attacks aren't going through. <laughs> so I'm, I'm just going to leave this up. Draw. It's a draw. I don't want to discard despair, but I don't have much of a choice. Drag down from the grave. Giant Trunade, you get discarded. Despair gets discarded, I get a new card. Um, actually, hang on. Let's see. Galahad loses 500 attack points during damage step when it's... when it's... Uh, when it's attacked. Yeah. It loses 500 life points when it attack... when it gets attacked. If I... 800 cut down is 1300. If I throw my big bang shot and equip it to Creebons, its attack points will be 1600. Then I can blow away this uh, this Gaia, Gaia Force spe uh, field spell. And... Uh, now Creebons, with its 1600 attack points, and with Galahad's um, lower attack points, due to its negative ability, is uh, can have its a its attack uh, negated. But that's okay. As long as it doesn't get another monster this turn, I should be fine. Because I still have life points left. I now don't have any more um, life points to spend. But I think that my decision... Uh, I there. My decision to keep um, my monsters, th my decision to keep Creebons kept me alive. It really did. I mean, the fact that I was forced to keep Creebons continually over over this time. Huh? Oh, okay. He's got two that he's choosing the special summon defense mode. Well, that's not going to help you because Big Bang Shot has piercing. I may win this because his life points are very low and he doesn't have any cards in his hand. Or he has one now. He just drew it. And it's enough. I think. I think it's enough. Well, it's enough to destroy me and itself. But it's, he's not going to use it. Okay. Draw. Magic Jam is not going to help me. I need to get rid of that thing now. It's a, th these are all tuners, so it's not much of a problem. Dark Core! I'll discard Magic Jammer from my hand to remove from play Air Bellum. Flicks do battle damage. Discard one random card. Yeah. Remove it from play. I can't afford to leave that thing on the field. My Big Bang Shot means that I my, any any attack deals damage. No matter how, no matter what mode it's in. So I'm actually next turn. If he doesn't have anything else to play in this next draw, I have actually won this fight. 
That's a that's a heavy storm. That's annoying. That may have actually uh, killed me right there. It'll depend on what he top decks. If again, if he doesn't top deck a monster, and if I don't top deck a monster, which I didn't, I did top deck a monster destroyer though. If he doesn't top deck a monster, then I still have time to work with. If he did, then I can, yeah, then I can sucker at Suamara. Or even better, I can sucker at Suama this instead. I can sucker at Suama Wayne, yeah. Sucker at Suama, destroy it. I don't like top decking. It's nerve wracking. Draw! Radiant Mirror Force is useless. I shouldn't actually have even bothered to put it down. Now I really have to hope that he didn't draw another monster. He did. Crap. No. <laughs> no. Oh, man. It all came down to top decking. Well. My luck isn't good enough to let me win with top decking. I have to win with strategy. <laughs> oh well. Um, yeah, so that was annoying. Oh well. <laughs> uh, stop pushing me around, jerk. Just because you won doesn't give you doesn't give you the the right to push me around. Right. Next episode, I'll fight this guy again and show you a win against him. So. I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye, everybody.